Good evening. I'm very happy that I'm here. Thank you very much for the invitation for such a good meeting. And I dedicate this uh, talk to my colleagues in Ukraine. The case 34 years old man with the radio tear, the combined type of tear uh, of the medial meniscus, um, pain, swelling, and ability to be weight on the left knee. Uh, examination, McMurray test positive. Radiograms normal on plane alignment normal and tibial slope normal. We can see tau the medial meniscus, uh, combined type, radial, horizontal, everything together. And what we found in atroscopy, um, combined type of the um, tear of um, medial meniscus. And what we have done? This is unstable tear, chronic tear, elements of the parot horizontal, Radiata. First, we, uh, we, we have, we've done an abrasion, then we stabilize meniscus. It's very important to stabilize. We prefer inside out technique. It is uh, to uh, vertical and horizontal to connect the gap of the meniscus together. It's very important to be sure that we stamp, we we are, we are doing we are doing very good good stabilization and if we uh, sure that everything is in place like here is the absence of the mass of the meniscus and why we we chose the Henning technique because we would like to support healing with the lemnus um, fasciolata this is the two uh, sutures for parachute technique and fasciolata is stabilized of this um, uh, treats um, to then to put inside to the to, to, to the knee uh, in the um, like tent parachute uh, uh, technique, and uh, if the um, fascia is in place, we stabilize them. Uh, we stabilize fascia first, a fast fix all inside technique, fast fix flex, and then uh, we precisely cover the gap of the meniscus with. Uh, fascia using the sutures inside out. We prefer not absorbable sutures. And uh, if everything is correct, then for better healing, we cover this with the membrane. This is instrument gold with the sharp ends. It's for easier putting membrane on the um, uh, meniscus. First, we stabilize the posterior part of the membrane on the meniscus with all inside technique. And then we prefer inside out um, to stabilize together membrane. Here, in this case, uh, fascia and meniscus to the capsule. And if we show that everything is correct on place, uh, we bend 10 times um, to be sure that uh, the membranes will, will not disappear. And we take bone marrow, fluid bone marrow from the notch. If it's not allowed in your country, you can do microfracturing. And in uh, dry atroscopy, we inject the fluid bone marrow between chondroguide and meniscus. And uh, MRI after 18 months in this patient, we can see meniscus in place, healed, in cartilage correct, and in clinical fin um, patient also uh, satisfied the, um, and, um, and also good uh, subjective scales, EKDC and Lisholm. For background, um, for the better healing, many doctors um, presented in papers, for some colleagues from Korea, and as a state with group the Scott Rodero using the, the bone uh, blood clot putting just in, um, for augmentation technique in a horizontal tear, like you can see here. Two years ago, Dr. Charles Henning presented his technique with covering radial tear with the fasciata and presented his good uh, results on it. And we met 11 years ago, Professor Roland Jacob, um, uh, who incepted the idea to uh, create atroscopic technique with uh, Hondro guides to augment, augmentation technique. 
this idea is to stabilize meniscus uh, if it's rupture in the white zone, white red zone, then cover with the chondroguide and put and put between inject between chondroguide and meniscus fluid bone marrow. Why chondroguide? Because it has two surfaces. First is dense and second is very friendly for cells. Um, porous and this porous we put on meniscus. And this uh, wrapping is also an algorithm of AOS uh, presented uh, by the group uh, of Escotrodea uh, with together with uh, with augmentation by PRP, fibrin clot, needling, uh, abrasion, and rasping. And we've done now uh, more than 500 cases. First, 50 cases for observation more than five years. We took. 14 isolated uh, meniscus wrapping of the hondro guide and white red white zone just with the uh, hondro guide and um, um, demographic typical uh, chronic injury uh, 40 year middle uh, middle age and results observation now after 10 years presented good results and stabilized results in, in subjective scale kdc and list home two, five, ten years. And also, if you compare uh, observation, uh, just meniscus uh, suturing wrapping uh, um, collate with the group with meniscus wrapping and AC uh, reconstruction, then we also we have the uh, uh, good uh, stable, stable results between two and ten years. And uh, also in at uh, least on KDC scales. And results after one, seven years, this period observation presented in, in, in our publication, the overall survival rate at the final, final, final follow up was 88%. And conclusion uh, ah, was, uh, the AMR is alternative technique to meniscectomy. Demonstrated a very good and uh, long term clinical and um, favorable survival rate at five years. And for isolated meniscus lesion, um, meniscus um, wrapping capillaries to prevent progression of degenerative cartilage changes up to 10 years. Thank you very much for your attention and we should not forget about our orthopedic colleagues who treat the victims of the awful war. Thank you very much.